Welcome to the Flora Sage Podcast, a place where we help you create a life you're excited about. Welcome back to the podcast. Today's episode is all about you and the results that you guys are getting. I'm so excited for this episode. If you're new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. I'm Flora Sage, minimalism mentor, simplification coach, and seven-time author. For over 25 years, I've been helping women like you align into a life that you are wildly obsessed with by helping you clear the nine types of clutter keeping you from a life that you absolutely love. What are those nine types of clutter? They are mental, spiritual, emotional, digital, financial, daily, body, process, and environmental clutter. My YouTube page is where I share environmental decluttering tips and tricks. And here on the podcast, I share with you how to declutter the rest. Please subscribe or follow this feed so you get notified every time an episode is released. And today, as I mentioned, and I'm so freaking stoked about this, we are going to talk about you and the results that you are getting. Frequently, after I post an episode, I get responses and comments from people in my email. I truly do read your emails. And this morning, (laughs) I had a podcast planned to record already, but I had to push that one back a week so that I could share with you some of the emails that I've been getting. Several weeks ago, after I shared episode 173, Decluttering Your Yearly Goals, I sent an email to frequent commenters of my podcast. These are people who email me sharing how my podcast has impacted them, what they thought of the episodes, all that stuff. And I asked them to try out just shifting from their regular, everyday, normal way of setting goals and to just pick one thing to focus on over the next couple of weeks. Then I said, after you've done this for two weeks, I want you to email me your results back. And that's what today's episode is all about. And oh my gosh, this is incredible. So I printed these out. The first one is from Susan. And she says, oh my gosh, Flora, I cannot believe I'm writing what I'm writing to you. When you sent your email to me, I was terrified of only picking one thing for my health and fitness journey this year. I decided on quitting sugar since that's what you shared in the podcast. Since quitting sugar for only two weeks, I am down nine pounds and can button my pants again comfortably. I've been wearing leggings since November of last year. I'm crying as I'm writing this email to you. Thank you so much for making decluttering so simple and so doable. The second email that I received is from Sharon, and I'm gonna paraphrase this because it was a very long email, but she said that her and her husband have wanted to go on vacation for years, but they haven't been able to afford it. After my financial decluttering podcast episode, and after I asked her to focus on just one thing from episode 173, she decided she was going to stop shopping on Amazon. And this is what she said. She said, Flora, I was able to save $378 towards my vacation that I would have spent on Amazon, and it was stuff that I did not need. This is huge. (laughs) Now, the last one that I'm going to share with you is from Katie, and she said, and I quote, Oh, Flora. Flora, Flora, Flora. I don't really know where to begin. When you asked me to pick one thing, I knew exactly what my goal would be, to declutter for just 10 minutes per day to see how far I got in two weeks. My partner of 25 years and I are downsizing and it has been a struggle for the last three years. In the last two weeks alone, I have been able to declutter my entire spare room. It is now completely empty. I've also decluttered by three quarters our main bedroom closet, the dining room, and our home office. You have truly illustrated through this podcast and through your downsizing series on YouTube that this is actually achievable. You have given us our life back and we're now able to see the light at the end of the tunnel. Thank you so very much from the bottom of my heart, Katie. 
I truly am in awe. Now these are only three of the emails that I received back from all of the people that shared their results. And I have to tell you that this truly can help you create and have the life that you want. Whether it's quitting sugar like Susan did and she's down nine pounds in two weeks. Whether it's downsizing your house like Katie and her partner or saving for a vacation like Sharon. Give yourself permission to implement the things that you're listening to, the things that you're hearing on this podcast. When I work with private clients, we're in the thick of it together. They contact me via our coaching app and they share with me their wins. They, they share with me things that they are struggling with. I coach them actively. The people that book single sessions with me, that's 90 minutes, hot and heavy, we're getting in there. I, we pick apart the stuff that's going on. I can help you identify your number one piece of clutter and give you an action plan on how to move forward. Or you can listen to this podcast and implement for yourself and be your own accountability buddy to get what you want and to get what you truly, truly desire in life. One of the reasons why I wanted to do this episode is because so often we sit here and we listen to podcasts and, oh, this is all fine and dandy. You listen to an episode and then move on to another episode from another creator and then another one and another one. And often people don't implement what it is that we learn. And I wanted to illustrate to you that the simple concept of just decluttering absolutely everything that's not necessary for the life that you want and just ask yourself, what do I want? What do I want? Susan wanted to lose weight and she did one thing, one thing. She stopped eating sugar. She's down nine pounds. She can button her pants again. Katie, 10 minutes a day. She's been trying to downsize for three years, two weeks. And she got, what is this? One, two, three, four areas. Actually five, wait, one, two, three, yeah, four areas done after two weeks. So many experts, and I've talked about this before, so many experts fill your minds full of all the bullshit. This podcast is designed to help work through a lot of the mental clutter that gets in the way of you being able to let go of the unnecessary. Life is simple. We don't need a ton of stuff cluttering it up. But modern marketing tells us we need all of it. We need it all to be happy. And in the 25 years that I've been coaching people, the happiest people get is when they get rid of all that BS. Is when they get rid of all the stuff that's been cluttering up their lives. And part of that is your goals. So today, if you did not implement what we talked about in 173, give yourself permission to say, what is my goal for this year? What are your top three priorities? Figure that out. And then don't pick 10 goals under that priority. Pick one thing. Pick one thing. And do that one thing every single day. And I will guarantee you that your life is going to get better. And you are going to start to see results faster than you've ever seen results before in your life. If you want my help with this, y'all know that I geek out with this stuff. <laughs> like this is what I live for. If you want my help with this, I am an expert at identifying the clutter that gets in people's way. If you're ready to see results, you're ready to have this year actually give you tangible results. So I've got two options in the comments for you. The first one is if you're not quite sure what you would be right for as far as coaching, if it's a single session or ongoing, click the link that says let's connect, fill out the coaching application, let's get on a call, we'll figure out if coaching together is a right fit, and then we'll go from there. I have lots of different options available as far as price point goes. Or if you know, you're like, you know what, Flora, I want a single session. Let's just do this. It's a 90 minute session. Click the single session link in the show notes. Also, let's continue this conversation and support each other in building lives you're not only wildly obsessed with, but are genuinely filled with so much joy and fulfillment. If you're listening to this on YouTube, I invite you all to share your experiences with decluttering your yearly goals and picking just one thing 
in the comments below. If you're listening to this on any podcast streaming service, email me flora at floresage.com to share your comments. And again, I do read every single comment. (laughs) If you found today's episode helpful, please subscribe, share with your friends, and please leave a podcast review. Your support helps this podcast reach more people looking to declutter their lives and align into a life that they are wildly obsessed with. I hope this serves you today. And remember, all it takes is a clear vision of what you want and the willingness to take one small shift in that direction daily to align into a life that you love. All links mentioned are in today's show notes. I'll see you in the next episode.